Our topics today are hepatic encephalopathy and lactulose. Lactulose is a non-absorbable sugar related in structure to the disaccharide lactose. Lactulose is not digested by the stomach or small intestine, but instead passes all the way to the large intestine. In the large intestine, lactulose is broken down by colonic bacteria into acetic acid, formic acid, and lactic acid. This action creates a hyperosmotic environment inside the lumen of the large intestine, which acts to draw water into the lumen. This added water softens the stool and also distends the intestine, which leads to an increase in peristalsis or gut motility and gets things moving. This action thus increases the likelihood of defecation. Therefore, lactulose is useful in the treatment of constipation. Another important indication for lactulose is usage in a condition known as hepatic encephalopathy. Hepatic meaning liver and encephalopathy referring to brain damage or malfunction. A healthy liver is an important organ for the breakdown of amino acids. Amino acids have a nitrogen-carbon-carbon backbone. The nitrogen group or amino group can be removed from the amino acid in a process known as deamination, which primarily occurs in the liver. Deamination also yields a leftover two carbon molecule that can either be recycled or broken down further by entering the Krebs cycle and oxidized to make ATP. The removed amino group becomes ammonia or NH3 and is toxic to the body. So enzymes in the liver add a carbon dioxide molecule onto the ammonia to form the much less toxic urea in a process known as the urea cycle. Urea can then be excreted out of the body by the kidneys. When the liver becomes damaged, it no longer converts ammonia into urea. So ammonia levels in the body and brain begin to rise. The brain is particularly sensitive to the effects of ammonia. Elevated ammonia levels can lead to brain damage, a condition known as encephalopathy. Lactulose administration helps to bring down ammonia levels in the body. When lactulose is converted by gut flora into acetic, lactic, and formic acids, an acidic environment is created that causes a change in the relative amounts of ammonia and ammonium ion described by this equation. The acidic environment, or additional hydrogen ions, causes ammonia, which is NH3, to be more readily converted into ammonium ion, or NH4. NH4 is charged and is therefore unable to cross membranes for absorption into the blood. So instead, it is excreted in the feces. This excretion leads to a reduction in serum ammonia levels for those with hepatic encephalopathy. Lactulose may be administered orally as a suspension or rectally by way of enema. Please pause the video now and choose the correct answer to this question. If you answered C, you are correct. Thanks for watching.